Hi oh, Gemini, how you doing? Let's see what energies and messages we have for you today regarding love. Energy and messages, please, for the sign of Gemini regarding love. Energies and messages, please, for the sign of Gemini regarding love. Knight of Pentacles. Walking through treacle, God, things are going slow. They're not progressing half as near as quick as what you would like. Could be you that's taking things slowly, though. Again, I'm picking up a test of commitment here, a test of some kind. Mm. Judgment. Somebody come back from the past. There's a connection here. Wants to revive. Something you thought was long finished. And well be you're in a new commitment and then suddenly this past thing rears its head. The sun. Mm. Probably make you happy and feel good. Feel flattered, but mm, there's, a, there's a big... It's a big judgment call on this. Now I'm picking up some hesitation. Yeah. King of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. I'm getting some stubbornness here, a reluctance. Uncertainty. Yeah. Trepidation. Not so much fear, but there's a history with this person. You're not sure you want to open the Pandora's box again. Yeah, it's kind of got you feeling stuck. That old eight of swords. Things going around in your head. I don't think you've fully healed from this person. Nine of Cups. There's, there's a lot of happiness around you at the moment. Or coming in at least. I feel, I feel you're going to find out a few things about this connection that you didn't know before. Be careful what you wish for. You might well get it. The energy that you protrude, the, your thoughts and feelings that you give out will come back. Yeah, I feel this person who you're dealing with is either in a commitment or they want to come back and commit to you. They're in a relationship. See how this goes. Queen of Wands, yeah. It's kind of one of those connections where there is love, fun and all the rest of it, but it's got to be on their terms. I feel that's a bit of you as well. I feel you're not so easily keen to, you know, give your all to it. Hmm. Knight of Wands. Do you know, I've done three readings this morning and this guy has popped up in all of them. You know, this person, in and out, in and out. You could well get an invite to travel to see them. Or, or them to come and see you quite unexpectedly. I feel the situation you're in at the moment, though. Yeah, there's, yeah, there's some regrets. You see, there's still some residual emotions here. Look at these two cups standing. You know, this kind of crying over spilt milk, but there's there's still some emotional connection here. You're still healing. You're still hurt by this person. Yeah, they want they want to resurrect it. Sagittarius energy. This is a reconciliation attempt.
Mm. Yeah. Look at that, the lovers. Wouldn't be surprised if this into soulmate. But you see this this volcano. It's this is the resid this is the emotions between you that you're still connected emotionally. That volcano sorry, that volcano is this. See? You're still connected emotionally. You know, doesn't matter how far you travel or how much you try to disconnect from this, I feel you can't. Yeah, look at that. I feel your perspective is opening up. It's not so kind of like tunnel vision anymore. It's opening up. You, you, you're learning to, to look at the big picture. There's certainly a history with this person, yeah. Yeah. Somebody here wants an opportunity. There's an opportunity. But somebody here, I feel, is you. You're kind of thinking it's best to sit tight at the moment. You know, probably do nothing. It wouldn't surprise me if you're not ignoring it. You're, you're sitting tight because you're, there's some healing here. Yeah, and there's some confusion, you see. There is, there's some very, very clouded issues on this connection. There's a lot of stuff needs clarifying. Yeah, there's definitely love here, look. I feel it's stirred up. This, I feel this person comes back and they stir up a lot of residual emotions. You know, things you're trying to forget. Emotions that you're trying to get over. And it's 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 like reboard the kettle, so to speak. Yeah, they're coming back around, look, the world card. The Hierophant is also Taurus energy. And you've got Taurus energy here. Your attitude towards this person's changing very quickly. Yeah, it's a soulmate. It is. To me, when you get this, the lovers and the two of cups in the same reading, that is a soulmate. Twin flame for some of you. Yeah, don't be surprised if they don't come in, you know. All proud, confident. But I feel they want to offer you something. Yeah, they can, they can feel the connection as well. Devil. It's definitely fire energy here, look. Look at that plumage. There's a lot of passion here. Passion, confidence, adventurous. But, yeah, they kind of want you to play their game. And that ultimately is down to you, whether you actually want to play this game or not. See, they kind of test the waters, tell you so much to kind of dangle the carrot. I am getting, they kind of want you to play their game. But I don't think you will wear that badge for too much longer, Gemini. I feel you'll make a Big decision on this. You'll make a judgment call. I've loved reading for you today and I hope to see you again very, very soon. Bye for now.